How's it going, all you most amazing top teners? Welcome back. I'm back. I'm Landon, and this is where I create top ten lists for your guys' entertainment. So today we have a great video for you guys. This is the top ten interesting facts about Michael McCrudden. So let's start off in at number ten. Michael was born in 1991 from Northern Ireland, and he's a professional footballer. Do I look like I was born in 1991? Do I look like a professional football player? I do not think so. Come on, Landon. Yo, I did my research at Wikipedia, and if you type in Michael McCrudden. Huh. Is this not you? It's my name. I am Irish, but that's not me. Well, whatever's on the internet is always true. Well, just to clear things up, because obviously there's been a few mistakes, I'm Michael McCredden, and I'm here to help you guys on this top 10 list about little old me. Okay, so I guess I'm, I'm, I can't get anything wrong now, right? Because now he's here. So let's let's seriously get into this list. So Michael McCrudden, for you guys that don't know, he runs the most amazing top five channels. If you guys want to check it out, it's right over his head. Give that a click. Also, the link will be in the description below. It's a great channel too. We do all sorts of crazy stuff. We got great co-hosts. We got Azzy. We got Amber. And uh, I bared my soul to the world on there with some amazing facts. So be sure to head on over there and check it out. And I just realized that he does half the work that we do here. Oh, come on. Yeah, well, we had the debate over who should do 10, who should do five. And I was like, I got eight other channels, so I'll take the five. Landon works a little harder than me. Okay, you, you stand over there. Let's really get into this. And at number 10, since Mike isn't a footballer, he doesn't even look athletic, I'm sorry. But let's talk about his many jobs he's had in the past. Not athletic at all, Landon? Come on, we just bought bikes together. Takes uh, a special man to ride as fast as I can. Now we're talking about jobs right off the top of my head. I've been a bartender, I've also worked construction, I have worked as a dance choreographer. Okay, I'm lying, but I used to get really crazy at weddings and teach everyone how to do the river dance. I worked in sales, I worked in retail, I worked for a giant carpet factory, and it was actually my dream job. I did it all through high school. It was pretty fantastic. My bartending, that took me out to Ireland. Then I worked at Inform Overload and on IO Trends. That introduced me to the world of YouTube. But I've also worked as an actor, working on film sets. I had to empty the garbage there a lot. It wasn't my favorite thing to do, but let's just say my resume is about eight pages long. I've done a lot of jobs. Wait, wait, did you also tell me that like you were a painter and like I think you missed a few other things? Yeah, I also tried to work at Medieval Times and uh, well, I didn't get that job. So uh, I've done some weird stuff. Let's move on. At number nine, Michael McCrudden has also been a part of many movies and TV shows. He has been in Dumb and Dumber 2. He appears in the scene right next to Jim Carrey laughing. You guys are looking at the footage right now. This is so awesome. He was flown down there to be a part of that amazing experience. He's also been close with Jim Carrey's sister, Rita Carey, who also worked with us in the past. Mike has also been in Rookie Blue, Breakout Kings. Those TV shows was filmed here in Toronto and he has appeared in one episode each. When it got down to Atlanta to be in Dumb and Dumber 2, I was actually lucky enough that the director, Peter Fairley, he threw me a line to make it to the movie, but then it never made it. You know, those guys at the studio, they're probably like, who's that Michael McCrudden? He makes a lot of weird YouTube videos. On top of that, I've been in all those shows that Landon mentioned. I've even done some extra work. I've been like driven cars and things like Heroes, uh, Stuntman, and then uh, Nikita was a TV show. I got to fire guns at like the lead lady, and I was really nervous because I never held a gun. And I was like, these better be blanks. I don't want some like crow stuff happening here, and all of a sudden my name's out there for the wrong reason. Blame it on that guy who plays football out in the UK. It wasn't me. He's also appeared in Nikita, Ghostly Encounters, Dual Suspects, and King, which are all TV series. Uh, you forgot to bring up my time hanging out with Dr. Phil. Oh, mm -hmm. actually that was a bad thing. Remember what they got really mad at me? He tried to get him very mad, but he didn't want to get mad. It was kind of like being on the Jerry Springer show. Now that we're talking about it, I'm glad you didn't bring it up. Okay, so let's not remember about you know, the Dr. Phil experience. That was, that's a story to tell. So in at number eight, let's talk about his YouTube success. He started back in 2012, actually working for me on Inform Overload. He was seen by hundreds of millions of times and he pitched the idea of a new channel and that's where IO Trends was born. He was the main host of that, interviewing a lot of celebrities. As you mentioned, Jim Carrey, his sister Rita Carey, she sat down, as did Kendra Sunderland. The world knows her as Library Girl, and I know her a little more intimately. Let's move on. There's Liza Stinton, she's from Big Brother Canada Season 1. Also, Nikki Benz. Uh, another girl. Oh, yeah. She was sitting right here, yeah. She's a little out there as well. I attract all sorts of types. She was the one that was going for the Toronto mayor. Yeah, it was very interesting. She definitely, uh... A porn well, star for mayor. Rob Ford was the one previous, so... 
they're like, this might actually be a step in the right direction. It wasn't though. And on top of that, we also had the winner of Survivor. Me and Landon are big Survivor fans. We're talking about Tony the construction worker, who's actually an undercover cop. Anyway, the guy is the bee's knees, and we gotta talk to all these people on IO Trucks. So Michael McCrun worked for me in the day, and at night he had a small idea brewing. So that idea was a new channel called Michael McCrudden, where he does a series called Before They Were Famous. After the show blew up, he started working for himself. He just left me and just did it all on his own. His channel is now close to 1 million subscribers and he has tens of millions of views. If you guys want to subscribe to his channel, I'll make sure to put the link down below. Go to his video and go spam it with most amazing top 10 sent me here. Go to all his videos, check him out. He does a lot of porn stars too. Okay, so let's move on to number seven. Mike does a video on YouTube talking about his abuse story. For the first time on the internet, he opened up about it, so let's, let's get him in here talking about this one. You had to bring that one up, didn't you, Landon? He had no idea script for this, all right. <laughs> <coughs> oh, there he goes. Uh, yeah, now this just got awkward, roll the crickets. I'm not the type of guy who opens up. I host this show, I bring in all sorts of crazy guests, and I have a whole lot of fun. What I want to do is entertain you guys. Uh, but I've been through a lot, and it's been a huge journey getting here, and you know, um, people can relate to that, and a lot of people have been asking, like, who are you? Who's the real you? So that's where I opened up and shared it with the world. That's probably the video you might want to go and check out if you want to know more about me. So it's a really interesting story to say the least. So if you guys want to check that out, I'll make sure to put that in the video description below as well. He has hundreds of thousands of views on that video. Okay, so enough of the abuse story. Let's move on to number six. Michael's most viewed videos are all about Mia Khalifa. And she's actually seen these videos. She tweeted him, and I, Mike is going to explain this one a lot better, but you'll see. Another awkward point brought up by yours truly. No, this was actually hilarious me and Mia Khalifa we talk on Twitter and like in the private message department because she had some explaining to do I posted a video on her this one was actually from most amazing top five it was about the strange facts about Mia Khalifa when it made its way to her after 12 million people had watched it well she then sent me a death threat why well I said she liked the football team that she doesn't actually support and she was pretty pissed off about it. Anyway, we've since hashed it out and we've actually had a sit down interview. That too was on my channel, be sure to check it out. Okay, number five, Mike has been talking about it slowly and Mike is his nickname, Mike McCrun is his channel name, but he actually has a lot of YouTube channels on here. And sometimes there's too many for him to name. I've asked him a few times and sometimes he gets stumped on his own channel. But let's go over it a little bit quickly and he's worked with me in a lot of future projects. We have the most amazing top five together, Science Faction, the cutest toy collector. He also has Bear for Breakfast. I think. I name them all. No, no, Landon, come on, man. You missed the Spanish channel. Well, your own channel, Michael McCrudden. Yeah, I also have a network. It's called McCrudden Entertainment. Ooh, we're missing got, something. Got, got Azzyland. I'm supporting Azzyland as well as Question Time. That's a politics channel. Question Time's a good channel. We're missing one. I cannot remember right now. Or maybe that is all of them. Uh, Until he creates one next week. Yeah, I probably will. I'm having a lot of fun doing this. Yeah. Okay, number four, Mike's not gonna like this one. He does, he has no idea what he's about to do. But he used to be an Irish dancer. Let's see some of those moves. All right guys, if you wanna actually see some proper Irish dancing, this is not the type of clothes to wear. But uh, we'll try what we can. You gotta point both your toes. Uh, let's try a simple heel and toe and one, two, three, and down, slide, and down, slide. Much more impressive than you get with the kills. All right, so it doesn't get better than that. Number three, Michael is obsessed with his dog, Buster, and he lets the world know it. Let's take a look at his Instagram. He has his dog everywhere, and it might be a little bit creepy, and I actually think he might be dating his dog, Buster. Also, I think Buster is going for president, so let's hashtag this video in the comment section below. Hashtag Buster for press. Number two, Michael McCrud is an encyclopedia for movie quotes, so you know what? Let's put him on the spot like we've done this whole video. Ah! I was wondering what would break first, YouTube or your ambition? So it's funny how he comes in with the Bane thing, because I want to hear a Bane quote. Peace has cost you your strength. Victory has defeated you. Wait, why do you have to hold here? That is what Bane does. That is how Bane stands. It's very intimidating. All right, next, Jim Carrey, go. All righty then, do not go in there. And finally, kill her boots, man. All right, next one, Forrest Gump, but Forrest Gump. it can't be that the box of chocolates, the life is chocolate. Oh, okay. <laughs> cue, cue the action, go. 
I gotta go back for Bubba. Okay, one more, one more, one more. Uh, mm, it's kind of like you and me. Me and Jenny were like peas and carrots. You wouldn't believe it, Jenny. He's just so goddamn smart. I read him his favorite book. I gotta go back for Bubba. Sorry, I just do a lot of this around the office. People are like, cut it out, Forrest, Bane, Jim, everybody. If that was good, hit the like button. If that was bad, hit the like button. Are you gonna risk all that? No! Oh, resistance is futile. All right, he can go be Bane right now. And finally, at number one, Mike McCrun almost made it in life many times before YouTube. But you know what? Let's just say that, thank God for his fails, and many of them, because without all of that, if he succeeded somewhere else, he may not have been on YouTube, and you wouldn't get before they were famous videos, and also his other successful channels. So let me talk about what I mean. Mike almost made it on Big Brother. Yeah, we almost got to watch him 24 seven on the internet, or on TV. Yeah, Landon's not wrong about this. Uh, like when I was four years old, my parents got me into modeling and into acting, and they went to school, I went to university, I went to college to do this kind of stuff. And because of that, I've been flown to LA countless times. There's been so many Many crazy auditions and I've always been like the guy who made it to like the number 26 spot but we can only take 25 probably because they were like he's a little out there but uh, I haven't tried to go for survivor that's something I might do in the future yeah but there's been countless reality TV shows acting jobs uh, writing producing I've really been close you know and you're hanging out in Hollywood you're like I'm here and then you're not. So that's, you know, the way it goes. And that's why I birthed my own channel before they were famous. Because these are interesting stories before people make it. Kind of like me right now. I think I'm gonna do it. When I hit a million, it's gonna feel like I have. Well, there you guys have it. That was the top 10 Michael McCrunt interesting fact. Let me know who to do next in the comment section below. And aren't we so glad that he failed at life so bad that he ended up on YouTube Listen, because he's great on here. Buying Buster was a great thing. Buster for Prez. Yeah. And you know, dating Kendra Sunderland, that wasn't bad either. Oh man, this guy has story for days. You didn't put that on the list, David. Oh what? dude, we're doing a part two. We're doing a part two. <laughs> All right, see you guys in another video, and I'll see you on my channel before they're fixed. So let me know what you guys think of this video in the comment section below. In the future, we have Furious P. We have a lot of other people that I don't want to name right now, because I don't have other people right now. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But when I have them, you guys will see them. We're taking this top 10 channel to the next level. Hopefully you guys are enjoying it, and I'll see you guys all in the next video.